people, it's Nadia. And Nicole, the Wealth Twins. Today's video is to tell you how to buy more Swab stock slices. This is a common question we're getting, so we've decided it's time to tell you how you can buy them, how often you can buy them, and we wanted you to know so you can increase your holdings of the companies that you already own. Truthfully, after researching it and trying it for ourselves, we realized it wasn't as straightforward as it as we thought it should it, be. It okay? should be much So more. we decided to contact Charles Schwab's customer service and see exactly how you would buy more stock slices on the Charles Schwab trading platform. And we also are going to use this video to tell you the trading rules so that you can keep adding these slices to your portfolio and keep building wealth. So with that, the way you buy more Schwab stock slices is like this. You go to the trade tab on the platform, Choose the Swap Stock Slice section on the drop-down menu. Find the stock you want using the company's name or its ticker. Buy the companies again as a slice or even buy them as a group again. If you don't remember the companies you previously purchased, go to your Accounts tab, look for the History section, and then click on Transactions. There you will see all the stock slices that you have bought. That's simple, right? Now that you know the way to buy more swab stock slices, let's go over the rules, okay? As far as we can tell, the only difference between stock slices and regular stock in your account is the original $5 minimum and the $10,000 maximum you need in order to buy. After that, you can treat the stock slice just like you would any other security in your account. That means you can buy more anytime you want and as often as you want during trading hours, yep. all right? In addition to that, after you buy your slices, even if you buy them as a group, when the slices are put into your brokerage account, you will see them listed as individual trades. It just makes things easier to monitor for accounting and trading and tracking purposes. Yeah, they're just listed as equities, so they're not under a special account like stock slices, like a category. It's nothing, okay? Now, if you now know how to buy more Swap Stock Slices, hit that like button for these twins over here. Yeah, also, if you would like to learn more on how you can use and start earning passive income just for holding your stock slices, check out our dividend investing playlist. Here's a hint. Dividend investing is the only way to have passive income in the stock market. I don't think that was a hint, guys. I think she told you. But still, watch <laughs> those videos. You're going to learn a lot, okay? We put a lot of info in there. We did. And took our time to make those videos, so check out that playlist, yep. all right? If you found value in this video, show these twins some love, hit the subscribe button, and share this video with someone you care about. Until then, see you guys in the next video. See you.